have been cyber attacks on some of our banks, with attacks which were followed by the vigilance of the banks and the security services. I was also told of an instructive story about a cyber attack on the IT infrastructure of Maersk, the world's largest container ship and supply vessel operator, by hackers who managed to deploy a ransomware called NotPetya. This malware, for four days, completely shut down the operations of the company because all of its computers, domain controllers, and network had been infected. Merck's saving grace was, quote, one lone surviving domain controller in a remote office in Ghana, unquote. Apparently, according to reports, that one computer in Ghana, which was located in Tema, at the time of the cyber attack, was off because of power outage in the area. <laughs> and as such, had not been infected. Maersk was thus able to retrieve its data and restore its operations because of that one computer located here in Ghana. It goes to show you how interconnected the world is and the importance we need to attach to this new global threat. It tells us also that on rare occasions, Dumso can have positive consequences. <laughs>